soldiers, sailors, airmen, marines, even those Space Force guardians and coasties out there. Welcome to VetCoin Bootcamp, a part of the VetCoin Vetiverse. For veteran, someone that supports veterans, or you're just interested in the blockchain, you're in the right place. Here at VetCoin Bootcamp, we tackle your most pressing questions about the blockchain using simple and easy to understand grunt speak. So sit back and relax, and we'll learn together. Today, we'll cover the subject, what is the metaverse? Well, the word metaverse contains meta, meaning beyond, and verse, short for universe. So it's a universe beyond the physical. According to some scholars, one can find the literary roots of the metaverse in science fiction and fantasy books, such as Lord of the Rings, True Names, Neuromancer, with the metaverse itself emerging in Stevenson's Snow Crash in 1992. In addition to books, the metaverse as a concept evolved through the 1970s and 1980s, with the advent of role-playing games like Dungeons and & Dragons and computer games, such as Habitat for the Commodore 64. As the internet became more mainstream in the 1990s, open-ended virtual worlds with user-creator content evolved, such as Web World, Worlds Inc., Active Worlds, and Online Traveler. In the 2000s, the development of worlds became more user-driven, increasingly monetized through platforms like Second Life, Solipsis, and Open Simulator. Popular culture reflected the advancement of metaverse ideas through movies such as The Matrix, Her, Inception, and Ready Player One, and in television shows such as The Black Mirror and Westworld. Without question, the idea of the convergence of physical and virtual worlds is in the public consciousness and continues to evolve today. The metaverse that's emerging today is a result of the convergence of numerous technological advances. The first group are virtual reality, or VR, augmented reality, AR, or mixed reality, MR. VR is a virtual world that a person in the physical world can enter through various means. AR is an overlay of the virtual on top of the material world. And MR is the idea that the physical environment interacts with the virtual in real time. Now all these three can be put under the umbrella term extended reality or cross reality or XR. And that's simply an umbrella term for any VR, AR, or MR technologies. Now, the other technology that's critical to understand if you want to know where the metaverse is going is the Internet of Things. Now, the Internet of Things uses sensors and intelligence devices to allow the physical and virtual worlds to interact with one another. Here, devices can sense aspects of the physical world and communicate to other devices online. The Internet of Things technology continues to converge with the new advanced areas such as big data, machine learning, and artificial intelligence. As this happens, the physical and virtual will overlap and may become increasingly indistinguishable from one another. The final group of technologies to understand revolves around the blockchain. So blockchain technology is also very important. Blockchain technology can build virtual trust, decentralized verification of transactions, and can be used to create communities using smart contracts, such as decentralized autonomous organizations. As Web2, the current centralized internet, evolves into Web3, the blockchain will provide the underlying framework for people to organize and even own virtual space, much like physical space. The identities that people create on the blockchain may have an increased impact on the real world, and communities they make will affect human behavior. If these technologies continue to advance at the current rate, and people to continue to live lives where the physical and virtual overlap, well, that's going to be a whole new world, and that's what we call the metaverse. Well, that about does it for today. We talked about the metaverse. And that is the universe beyond the physical, where the physical and virtual worlds are continuing to combine based on technology such as the blockchain, Internet of Things, and virtual augmented reality. So, as always, if you have any questions, please leave them below, and we try to get to all of them. If you have a good question, we can take it and we'll use it as a subject for a future Bitcoin Bootcamp episode. Now, also, Bitcoin has a Vetiverse, if you haven't heard of that. Go to our website and check it out. And just a friendly reminder, this video today was brought to you by VetCoin, where our mission is to harness the power of the blockchain to connect, enable, and transform veteran communities. If you want to join us, visit www.vetcoinhq.com. And if you see that QR code on the right, if you scan that for a limited time, you will get free VetCoin airdrop to your wallet. So all you got to do is scan that barcode and follow the instructions. So as always, we salute you veterans and we'll see you in the Vetiverse.